we are off to the dry tortugas. We made it! Barely. They run out of fuel. There's a zombie apocalypse, we should all just come here. <laughs> Not stealthy. You can do this. No, you're like a sand squint. So it is approximately 6.15 in the morning and we are off to the dry tortugas. Are we ready to ship off? Yeah. We left the Lower Keys and headed along Hawk Channel to Key West. From Key West, we charted a course directly to Iowa Rock and the Dry Tortugas. We passed through Rebecca Shoal, Isaac Shoal, and the Quicksands. If you decide to go this route, be very careful in the Quicksands because you have wind against tide and also the currents from the Gulf and the Atlantic converging. Even on forecasted calm days, the Quicksands can be very dangerous. Mr. Frigate. We made it. Barely. That's not from anywhere around here. This is all granite. That's not even from Florida. Ooh. This is what Chris should have put in his house. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, you yeah, see, if we had enough fuel, 345 miles, we could go straight to Cancun. Oh. Isn't that nuts? 400 miles. We would need 400 gallons. Oh wow, this is cool. person in there. What's a mortar? It's just a different type of cannon. I got the front plug so I can't even put my hand in there. <laughs> oh no, they're rifled cannons. They are cannons. Oh. They don't take a cannonball, they take a bullet. Can you imagine if you found one of They take bullets? a bullet? Yep. I bet if you figured out how far they shot, if you went out here and snorkeled around, you'd see the the plug. Oh yeah, you can see the rifling on that one. That's on the screw. Oh, that's okay. 1865. Okay. 
Everybody says don't come when the ferry comes. Loggerhead Key. So this is Loggerhead Key? After exploring the lighthouse, we drove around Loggerhead. And on the northeastern side, we hooked up to a mooring and went diving there for the day.
So we'll just go somewhere over there and drop anchor. We have a rock nut anchor that we got. And when I set the anchor, or checked on the anchor last night to make sure it was okay, there was three giant goliath groupers below the boat, which was amazing. I wouldn't recommend your first overnight anchorage a hundred miles away from home, but it went well. So we're gonna go to Pulaski Shoal so we can go scuba diving. On the map, here I'll show you the map. It has some expectations because the map says good scuba diving. There's Pulaski Shoal, that's where we want to go. All this. So we can either come out here and then go up, this is where we want to go. Or we can cross, cross these bars. We did it yesterday fine, right? <laughs> as long as you don't hit. I think it's rougher today than it is yesterday. Yeah, that's true. You ready? The dive was cool. We saw those two big groupers out in their natural habitat instead of just by the boat at the anchorage for some reason, but they were cool. They were curious, kind of came over to us, but. All right, it's about time to leave. We got the boat kind of put together. It's a mess, but we're about 76 miles to the back country in the Gulf. Ready? <laughs> Frigate birds are on the tower. I don't know how to listen to the beeping. They must be deaf. <laughs> got a fog horn here. We got something. What you got?
the turtles. <gasps> oh fuck, we scared him. Why? Why, Amanda? Oh, I didn't mean to. Motherfucker. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I was, oh, I was so, so fucked. That could have been so ah! good. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mr. Turtle. Please come back. Shit. Not stealthy. Fucking doofus. No, you're like a sand squint. Oh, wait, he's coming back. He's coming back. Go over there. Go, 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 go. Oh, he can't see you. He knows I'm here. Maybe he'll come back. 